Yo, hey guys, in today's video, I will be showing you guys comparing Mid Journey and also Leonardo.ai, which is the best software to generate your AI image. We are going to compare the coloring of book pages. So, if you guys like this video, please do smash that like button. And without further ado, let's go. Alright guys, so before anything, we are going to proceed with the first thing that we should do is we are going to see the settings for Mid Journey and Leonardo.ai before we are going to generate our AI image. So here we got my settings for my Mid Journey. And what my setting I usually do is that I make sure to use the latest model which is the 5.2. And also, the one thing that I realized is I turn on raw mode because I realized that when you turn on raw mode, it is more good when you are going to create a blank coloring page, a black and white coloring page. Okay, I prefer a raw mode. You guys can see the difference if you guys are not use a raw mode and you use a raw mode. If you guys don't use the raw mode, the image will be too much grayscale. Okay, and my stylized, uh, if I want to use a kids coloring book or not adult coloring book. Usually, it's better to use a stylized or low stylized because the lower, the less uh, detail it will be, less shading that it will use. So, make sure to use a stylized low or stylized medium. And public mode, I just turn it on. Remix mode, also, I just turn it on. Doesn't matter. And now, I also use a low variation mode because I don't want my coloring book to be too much detail, too much variation. So, I just want it to be simple. And last but not least, I turn on fast mode. And that is my settings for my mid journey for this video. And so here is my Leonardo.ai settings. And one thing that you guys have to take note is that my Leonardo.ai, I use the free version. I don't use the paid version. So I don't know if there's an, any difference between the paid version and the non paid version. But mine is free version and mid journey. I use the basic plan, the $10 plan, the most basic. Okay. Now, first of all, my setting, I use it just two images, okay? For Mid Journey, it generates around four. And Leonardo.ai, you can generate until four, but I only choose two because as you guys can see, for each image that you generate, you have to pay a more, what we call this thing, tokens, okay? And for Toriel, I'll turn it off because we are not going to create a realistic image. I just want to create a coloring book pages. Alchemy, I just uh, turn it off. Prom magic, okay. This I turn it on. Prom magic is when you want the image to be more related to your prom. The higher your prom strength, the more it relates to your prom, okay. So, so for me, I usually leave it at 0 0.3 or 0 0.4, but for this video, I set it for 0 0.3. For high contrast, is when uh, they give our image a more shadow and I turn it off because I want my image to have less shadow, less shading. I just want it to be a blank white with lines, a black lines, okay? So I turn it off. And let's see what else. We got public image, I just turn it on. Upgrade image dimension. For this video, I will be comparing with image journey. I use a ratio of two by three, okay? And the guidance scale, I just use a seven. The more higher the prom, the more the more the strong the image related to your prom. So an example here, how strongly your prom is weight, just leave it leave it as a seven, the most average as default settings. The tiling I just leave it off because I don't want uh, the image to generate the repeating texture or background, and that's just basically it. So this is all my settings, and now we are going to see. The image that I've created using both of this software. Okay guys, so here we are our first image that I have generated using Mid Journey and also Leonardo.ai. And by looking at this image, can you guys guess which one is from Mid Journey and which one is from Leonardo.ai? Okay, now let me introduce you to you guys is that actually the left side, which is a left side right here, I don't know if the camera you guys see which one I'm pointing but this image right here that I'm moving this is from mid journey okay and the right one right here is from liarno.ai okay when you guys see there's a few things that you must be asking is that why is mid journey look really good and leonardo.ai looks to a uh, grayscale okay now one thing that I realized from both of this picture is actually first of all Liarno do a great job 
on making a blank what we call it a white color background it is suitable for people to color and leonardo.ai have a grayscale but this grayscale thingy you guys can uh, what we call it edit using a photoshop or photopia or many software in the website so considering even though they have a grayscale thingy right here the image actually look quite good but there's one thing that I realized is that Leonardo.ai usually give us what we call this a background image and one thing that I don't like is that of those a background image if I can remove it I will remove it and maybe it is all because of my prompt also but the prompt that you guys can see that I use is in the middle cartoon of a fox children coloring book page no color I make sure to put no color and also white background but it turns out like this so in in the end it's all depend on you guys which do you, you guys prefer but for me i think on both of this image looks perfect it's just that the leonardo.ai version which is the grayscale thing right here is too shading so maybe we can edit it out but don't worry i will show you a second example okay guys so here we got our second image and the second prompt okay as you guys can see the prompt that i use is actually really simple coloring pages fox and a white a blank background and as usual the left side of the image is mid journey and the right side is leonardo.ai okay as you guys can see two of this image is really beautiful we can't deny it it's just the style of the image is quite different the left image is looks more realistic to a fox and the right version a more like an artistic version of a fox like drawing of a person and the right image we have a background of a leaves i don't know how do i want to get rid of it <laughs> i white white blank background no no background or something like that but they are still uh what we call this a uh, background image maybe that is my bad there's some prompt that i need to put to remove the background so yeah you guys decide which one do you guys prefer for me i really prefer mid journey Okay, it looks really good. Now we are going to jump onto our third prompt. And so this is our third prompt, our third image that we are going to review. And for this image, I'm, I'm focusing on what I call it, something that have background. I want to make sure the full page is full of uh, things or object that people can color. So as you guys can see, my prompt right here, I put coloring pages. I want to make sure the first prompt would be coloring pages butterfly on flowers low details and also a line art this time i add on line art so that they want uh, so the drawing can be a more what we call it simple all right so the reason i use a butterfly on flowers is because i want to make sure the background is full of flowers so let's see which of this image that they can generate a more better so first of all as usual we got our mid journey image which is really a beautiful image a black and white image with butterflies on flowers as you guys can see i think this is really a good on uh, coloring book and then we got leonardo.ai okay one thing that i realized is that leonardo actually do a really good job for this image it's just that the image turned out to be a blue i don't know why it looks kind of blue but just from the image alone it looks really good and one thing that i realized is that uh, mid journey if you guys want to get a coloring a book pages it is suitable if you guys only write a simple prompt and then they will give us a great result okay so example you guys can see this is a, the example of it the proof of it okay maybe leonardo.ai uh, if you guys know a tips or two that what i should do to improve the uh, prompt but for me just a simple prompt we got these two results okay and then we are going to jump onto our fourth prompt and this is it guys the fourth prompt today and for this prompt i am focusing on creating a mandalas pattern okay and i know for coloring book it is quite famous or it quite people use it mandala patterns okay but before you guys gonna skip I have two types of prompt that I want to show you the mandala prompt first I just use the simple and then the second one I will show you the 
uh, what we call it the longer prompt so we are going to see the short prompt first the first prompt i use is coloring pages mandalas patterns line art no shade so this is a really simple prompt and the left side is the mid journey one which is a uh, really uh, simple and really beautiful and really what we call it same size and everything and the right one is the leonardo.ai and as you guys can see it is more complicated and one thing that is looks a little bit grayish or bluish but i think this is can be solved using editing software so basically for this prompt we have created these two types of image so let me show you when I use a more better prom, a more longer prom. Let's see. So this is it guys, the more longer prom that I use, which is, as you guys can see here, black and white full page pattern coloring page for kids, radial, yada, yada, yada. And one thing that I want to shout out is that I use this uh, YouTube channel right here, Profit, Stacking Profit or something like that, I will put in the screen. I would like to say thank you to him because I use his prompt to create both of this image. So you guys can check his channel out. So we are going to proceed. As you guys can see here, using this prompt, the left image that I created is from Mid Journey. Okay, and it looks good and everything. And the Leonardo.ai, Leonardo I've created this image right here. Also look really good. So. I summarize that in conclusion is that if you guys have a better prom, your image will turn out a better. Okay, it looks really good at all. And one thing that I want to show you guys, there are lots of images that I created using this prom. As you example that I checked from Leonardo.ai. So this image right here is also generated from that prom. This also this also so you guys can use this prompt if you guys want to create all these types of picture for this is leonardo.ai so let's see the mid journey one there's a lot of image so uh okay this i use the longer prompt thingy and also they give the colorful one we got this uh pattern or uh, this pattern and everything uh, looks good so in the end you guys decide which is the most best for your taste is it mid journey or leonardo.ai but we are not going to end there we are going to proceed all right guys so here we are we got our fifth prompt which is i created a vehicle uh, ai generated image which is a monster truck okay the prompt that i use is coloring pages monster truck on mountain and i've added no shade okay and you guys can see the left image mid journey i've created uh, a monster truck and i think it looks really good for a coloring pages we don't see any gray shading or anything for the right picture also we don't have any gray shading actually maybe some black shade thingy but i think it's uh forgivable so leonardo.ai is the right image something more unique for mid journey they just give us a simple image of a truck on a mountain but in the end because that is what my prom that i wrote <laughs> Okay, so we are going to jump to the last prom, which is food. So last but not least is the last prom that I created, which is the food category. And for the last prom that I use is coloring pages, desert on table and no shade. And surprisingly, some of the image, they are doing good and they don't put a desert, the Sahara desert on the image. So it seems that they understand my prom because my prom is really simple i don't have many explanation on it so uh as usual the left side is the mid journey version we got a cake we got i don't know what is this a spread something we got muffin or everything like that and for the right side is the mid journey uh, sorry the right side is leonardo.ai also we got cupcakes cupcake ice cream and so on so on so for the last prompt, actually, I prefer both of this image. They have a both of those quality, the good quality. And yeah, that's basically it. <laughs> and let me know what you guys pick. Is either you guys choose Mid Journey or you guys prefer Leonardo.ai. So yeah, that is all for today's video. So if you guys like this video, please do smash that like button. And if you want to see more, please do consider subscribing. And I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye-bye. See ya.